seed and pasture is where the Lord styled us as trees. Yes. Uh -huh. And he did that. But as he look upon the church today, is he just seeing leaves? Amen. Is he looking at the fruit that is on the tree? Yes. Are you producing the fruit that God is calling for us to produce? And as I began to stand in my kitchen, when the Lord began to speak to me about how he went, and the multitude followed him, and as the multitude followed him, the Bible said that Jesus looked out upon the multitude, and the Bible said that he moved with compassion. Yes. And the Bible said he looked out and he said that he looked at the sheep, the people as sheep without a pastor. And I began to say, Lord, give us the eyes of you. That's yeah, right. Because yeah, when we look yeah, out yeah. on the center, man, yeah, and look out yeah. in the world, what do we see? Do we see people as sheep? Mm -hmm. But no, we're quickly judging and say, look at the goat. Look at the center, right. man. That's right. But Jesus didn't do that. That's right. Even in the midst of the multitude, there was goats, there was sheep, there was uh, the problem. Some of everything, some of everything that was in that multitude. Well, God looked out, he looked out the multitude, and he styled every one of them as sheep. Yes, yes, and so yes, I'm praying that we yes. get the eyes, the mind of God, and that we count those things to be not if though they were. We got to begin to see out of the eyes of Jesus. We got to begin to see the people as sheep. As long as we see them as somebody and just stop looking that's at right, people right, as just right. sinners out in the yes. world, then yes. we can go out and we can harvest this world. Yes. Yes. But we yes. got to have a yes. love. We got to have a compassion for the people of God. Yes. But as I go forth, I just thank you, praise God, for Pastor Sister Harden, yes. that they invited us here.